from Sandy, Utah. I grew up in Russia. Uh, it's a city called Taganrog, uh, right by Ukraine. I lived there for 11 years. I was born in Novosibirsk, which is like Siberia. I'm an only child. Family life was really important to me. They cared for me. They wanted to right. give me the best opportunities they could, which is you know, how I got my musical education, or mm -hmm. how it started at least. So. My mom and dad split in Russia when I was about six. I don't think the media or the world even knows what a rock band is anymore. Jonas Brothers, Hannah Montana, those are considered rock bands. They have these commercials on TV that they have this, uh, you know, kind of very young, teenage, hip kind of crowd. And it's all very commercial and it looks commercial. It looks like a bunch of Hollister kids that picked up, you know, plastic instruments because that's what it is. A lot of the rock is it's about, you know, sex, drugs, and rock and roll. It's a little grittier and a little more even sleazy in ways than it, it, is, it is portrayed. And like, you know, rock and roll is about having a good time. It's about, you know, chilling with your friends and banging your head to your favorite songs. It's not about this fake image of, oh, you know, we're playing and the lights are on us. And like bands when they were starting out, you know, they didn't have any financial support. So, you know, they'd have to, you know, crash at their friends, you know, on their friends' couches. You know, there's a really kind of like, a, almost like a bum-like quality to a lot of musicians, at least before they hit it big. And that's kind of, how I see it is, you know, there's a lot of these rich, rich kids that are playing these rock band games and like, oh, I'm a rock star, but, you know, it all goes back to, you know, that rebellious teenage, my parents are Christian, don't want me to play electric guitar, kind of, you know, that, that's that's how I connect with it and that's how I see it and that's that's what it is to me. It's a, it's a rebellion, but it's, you know, it, it's about the cool life of rock and it's about, you know, the music, but, you know, there's a lot more to rock and roll than there is just the music. The people I have, I'm playing with right now, they're just only starting to develop as musicians. You know, they're not bad, but they're only starting to develop as actual musicians versus, you know, being a skilled player. I'm hoping that, you know, they'll just play what I tell them to, but eventually that they kind of develop a hearing for where maybe I'm going to take the song or how, you know, it would sound better. As it's looking right now, it's just going to be easier if I tell them what to play. If somebody comes up with a good idea, I'm not going to say no, you know, I'm... I'm I'm never gonna just deny another person, you know, their sure. creative idea. I'm just, I just like to be in control. Right, right. Control freak. Yeah.